Hey guys and welcome to part two of my um, Let's Play Sims. Uh, Let's Play Cities in Motion series. Um, last time in part one we uh, we set up a bus line, we set up the company, and we set up a bus line. So this time, as I said, I'm going to be doing the next job, setting up a tram line. Now the first thing you need for a tram line is tram track, obviously, and um, like I said, you want to integrate. Now these are going to be the busiest bus stops, so my advice would be to run or try to run in a way a tram line if we can it's difficult because the way the city's laid out from here but doesn't look like we're going to get to do that so we're going to I'm going to start it here and basically what I'm going to do with the tram line is and uh, there's a there's a method to this is run it round this sort of kind of ring road thing joining the ring road in a way now the thing is it does go red sometimes and the reason for that is that tram lines don't always have to follow roads and I'll just show you that here that you can actually build if it goes green there you can build tram lines across land across urban land across concrete and stuff like that so yeah here we are joining up the um we're joining up to the bus system again and um yes you can run it down the line a, a road with any road with a bus system on and i'm going to run it out this way oops so you didn't put it in there you've got to be careful um where are we? Oh, there we are. So... And... Hopefully, I'm going to run it across to, um... Oh, it won't let me. Okay. I'm not going to cooperate then. It can be difficult sometimes. I didn't actually want to put that in there, so I'm going to delete that now. You see, you've got to kind of run it. I don't want to run it in a full circle if I can avoid it, because it's difficult with the vehicles. So, I'm going to try and find a block I can get round. Well, I've just gone round in a... In a, in a full block there. <laughs> okay, I, I guess I've already joined it up then. That's okay, that's not a problem. Um, it's just going to be a little bit awkward with the stations, but it's no big deal. Well, of course, this ends loose. Might be a big deal. Um, and this could take a long time. Okay. Okay, we'll run it along here. Damn it! And um, I've got an idea to join this up. We'll join it up there. Okay, so maybe not such a problem. This is going to be a, a very complex tram system, though. I don't know if we'll even have time to set up the underground system, because this is a bit more complex than I wanted it to be, but that's life. So, yeah, you want to set up your tram stations in the vicinity of your bus stations as best you can. And that is, of course, you can see the white line there is the boundary, and the buildings going green are the buildings that are now reachable by mass transit. So, uh, yeah, I'm doing this as fast as I can. Junctions, you're not allowed to put a uh, tram station on a junction. You're not allowed to put tram stations in various other areas as well. It's just common sense, really. You're not allowed to put them on hills, either. You're not allowed to put any station on a hill, which is a bit gay, but it's still a good game. Doesn't bother me. Um, just a little annoying. And... 
basically you're following this tram system right round round the block where we built it and put one there as well would be very good healthy for the uh, yeah I didn't build a line up there healthy for the uh, system and so we've got two blocks in there I can see and now we just it's just a case of um, it says no point in putting a, a station out where where nothing's reachable put it here where people are going to use it you've also got a handy little uh, information thing here when you're not on the build tool that shows you uh, displays like placement, displacement of homes, displacement of workplaces and you can kind of base your lines on that if you're really really stuck but make sure you integrate it with different types of mass transit or it will not work and I mean that now we're not going to get the underground in part 2 I'm afraid guys but we will get the tram system in And what would be a good idea is to um, maybe build another bus line out here, joining up this, and then build a subway line crossing all the lines. And and but it's not just about crossing over it as in bridge over river, if you like. You've got to cross over it as in you've got to put a sta stations next door to each other, so they um, so it works basically. So people hop off a tram and hop onto the subway, or hop off a bus and hop onto the subway, you know. Um, also make sure you put your station there, you, your stops in the right way, or it's a nightmare. I've got a couple of turning points here that I can um, use in my, uh, in, in my favour for that. Um, See, as you can see, that's that's difficult. It's difficult because there's no place for the uh, trams to be able to turn. So we're gonna have to. I'm gonna have to um, put it round here, which is a little annoying, but it's not too severe it's because basically I've got two big blocks and what you want to really try and aim for when you're building a tram system is a line like a bus line like I had there with two turning points one at either end that's what you want to aim for yeah I'm gonna have to build a build an, a block here in here to turn this right round and go back the other way basically This is really not good. Um, right, I have to pick out that apartment building, maybe, and that tree, and hope that that works. Come on, I've got much time left building this. I'm going to try and get this line finished. Oh yeah, I had it there. There we go. That's what I want to do right now. Uh, back to adding stops. Quickly. We that before off. That's after the junction, so we'll do it like that. Turn it right round. And I'm afraid that's all we've got time for, guys, in uh, part two. So in part three, we'll have to build the um, um, the system, the the underground system, which will definitely happen. Because as I'm talking to you now, I'm just finishing off this uh, this tram line. So yeah, we're out of time, afraid, and I'll see I'll see you guys in part in in part three.